You know, this time we're just sitting back, relaxing. It's the first Friday. We're in downtown Bentonville. I'm with my man, Mr. Heath. He How is the doing? executive director of the Downtown Bentonville, Inc. A lot of people call you the DBI. Yep, we are. We're the DBI for downtown, and uh, we're out here right now getting ready for International Festival, our first Friday, and uh, the weather could not be better. It's a little hot, but I think it's going to be fantastic. You guys have battled some weather this year, but hey, you take the good with the bad, and every weekend people come out and support this event. They really do. So we, we do about seven first Fridays a year, and so far out of the six that we've had, we've been rained out five times. So it's been a really challenging year. There's no chance of rain today, so I think there's going to be a lot of people here. And speaking of the people, what's the support been like, especially in a, a community like Bentonville here in Northwest Arkansas? They tend to really get behind events like this. What have they been like? They've been really fantastic because DBI exists to make Northwest Arkansas an incredible place to live and work and play. So the people that live here, they work intensely in their jobs. We have a lot of really incredible corporations that I don't even need to mention because everybody knows. So they need to get away from that once in a while, get away from the workload, get away from the intensity, and DBI provides those opportunities. So whether it's a First Friday, whether it's a farmer's market, whether it's our Christmas parade, whether it's lighting in the square, we try to make this almost like a respite, that they can put work behind them, come out with their family, not spend any money, and have a really fantastic time. Whose idea was it to come up with a theme for each Friday? So in the past, we, we as an organization, we started drifting into almost like just a carnival every month. And I thought it was really important last year that when I came in as executive director, that we really make them thematic so that one doesn't feel like the next. So when we started this year, our first theme was growing greener. It was all about recycling, reusing. International Festival has been a theme for a couple years now because we've really identified that as an important topic that this community needs to embrace. Our diversity that makes Northwest Arkansas so unique, we embraced that a couple years ago and we've been running with it. And we're very fortunate that tonight Werther's Original, the candy, which actually started in Germany, is our title sponsor. So they wow. actually roll into our international theme as well. So what does the future hold? The future is always bright, isn't it? Especially in Northwest Arkansas. Downtown Bentonville Link is a nonprofit. So, you know, we, our future is like any nonprofit in this area. We always are challenged on how we're going to raise our funds, where it's going to come from, are we going to be here tomorrow? But this community is so supportive of what we do, I feel pretty confident that we're going to be able to have a future that's just as bright, if not brighter, than what we've been at. Well, I know it was a busy day, so thanks for taking some time Absolutely. with us. I can't wait to go check it out, maybe grab a corn dog. Great. All right, I'm out of here. How fun is it to come out here and enjoy uh, enjoy the downtown? Oh, it's a blast. You know, we come been coming up here for years now, and I bring the dog with me. She's a therapy dog, so this is a good opportunity for her to get practice in. And we come up here every first Friday, and we try to get here early before the big crowd. Uh, but, yeah, we just keep coming. It's a great opportunity for us to get out and just get around. Over two decades in this town and in northwest Arkansas, how much has it changed, and how nice is it to to live in a place like that we do. Well, I was just telling someone I, a few minutes ago how blessed we are to live here in this town. This is just a wonderful town and the change has been phenomenal. And the, um, there's families in this town that have been so generous in donating their time and money and gracious to provide all the benefits that we all enjoy. One last question, if no one's ever been to First Friday in Bentonville, what are they gonna experience? Oh, they're just gonna experience a good time. They're gonna experience a lot of friendly people and just a good time. And Kate the dog. And Kate the dog. Say bye, Kate.